In just a few weeks, thousands of students will graduate from Northeast Indiana colleges and look for a job. But with unemployment numbers relatively still high across the country, what are their chances of finding work? News Channel 15's Randy Spieth spoke to people at a couple of area schools today to see what they have to say about it. Randy? Well, Heather, I spoke with the career service directors at both Ivy Tech and Trine University. Between the two schools, they'll have more than 1,500 graduates this May, and grads in several fields will have more, many more jobs available than they did a year ago. This summer, companies are expected to be bringing on new employees, and many will be coming right out of college. Now the employers are saying, I'm ready to hire now, and, and the economy is better for me, so now I can bring more people on. Whereas it, they couldn't bring them on, it wasn't because they didn't have the positions, they just didn't have the ability to pay for someone to come on. Chris Pearson will be graduating from IPFW this year, and has also heard the job market is picking up. Companies, you know, that did let people off now have openings and they need to fill those. At Ivy Tech, a two-year school, there's been a 20 percent increase this year over last and the number of students landing full-time jobs shortly after graduation. In the last six months we've noticed a big uh, increase in the number of employers that are contacting us for jobs. At Trine University, where many students were in four-year degrees in engineering and technology, students are job hunting months before graduation. Those who do land a job before May usually worked with a company while in school. Turned their internship into a full-time employment opportunity or they're an in-demand field and so they were out there doing the job, starting the job search early. Students wanting to have a full-time job lined up by graduation day should already be starting their search. Heather, the National Association of Colleges Employers says on average it takes about seven and a half months to, uh, for grads to find that first job. Okay, thanks Randy.